Hi, uh, Mitch Bailey here. I want to. Uh, I had a comment. Somebody uh, had uh, lost some sizes and some things weren't showing up, and I want to show a quick thing. So I'm going to draw. Here's just a typical plan. I'm going to draw some ductwork real quick. So I click on my HVAC shape. So I'll uh, click on here and I'll drag it over for this register here. And there's there's the, now the duct's drawn, but if you notice, you don't see. You can see the registers, but you can't see. Uh, um, uh, any sizes or any of that stuff. So, person asked me, says, "Well, I, I I lost my my sizes and stuff off my ductwork, and so what? How do I get that back?" Well, the way you do that is, if if you can't see sizes and stuff like that, right click off of the drawing, and your property sheet will come up, and go to notations, and you'll see. Uh, so let's just do the duct first. So here it says duct contains. You're going to click on it and bring down it. I want the size of the duct, so I just click on it. Again, I'll click off of the onto the onto off of the drawing there, and all my duct sizes are now on there. Well, now I want the register sizes. So, again, I'm going to uh, write, I'm going to click off of the drawing, go back to notations, go to register contains, and I can put in the size or the airflow, size and airflow. A lot of times I'll just do airflow because I really don't, I really don't care uh, what size register because maybe the register is existing and I just want to note how much the airflow is. So I'll click on airflow again, click off of the property sheet, and there they'll all come up. And so I can see the CFM for each of these registers. Uh, just a quick tip. So if you lose that stuff, go to your property sheet, click off of the uh, off of the drawing, go to your notations. You can change all that. And again, here I'm going to change this register. Now I, let's say I do want to know the the airflow and the size, so um, I can go over here and go down to size and airflow. Boom! Right click, and now I got my register sizes are right there in the CFM. So just a quick tip, just in case you lose all that stuff when you're doing. Sometimes it happens. I've I've had where I've I've lost you know my property sheet or, or not my property sheet, but my HVAC shapes uh, disappears. So let's say if I close that, I can go back up here and and I just go to the uh, show. I'm sorry, go to uh, um, your uh, uh, drawing, go down to show HVAC, and the, the shape box will come back up so you can get to it. That's just some quick tips if you, if you don't. And if this is not on your property sheet, all you have to do is right click. You can right click on a room, and it'll bring up the property sheet. And if, if you right uh, click off of the drawing itself, it'll change over to all these other ones. If it's on the drawing, you click. It's going to bring up that room. It's going to bring up the walls, the ceiling, the floors, in case you need to change some of those. So just a couple of quick tips for you. Uh, thanks for watching. Oh, please like and subscribe because uh, that's how it helps the algorithm. And I hope this helped uh, the guy that was that commented. Thanks again.